Hello out there, and welcome to Smallville Panel. I'm your host, Matthew Roca, and my guests tonight are Lex Luthor, Lionel Luthor, and of course, our hero, Clark Kent. Hero. <laughs> I don't know about that, but I'm glad to be here. Tonight we're here to discuss the Season 5 episode, Cyborg. In this episode, I got my hands on a, um, a DVD of Clark using his powers. I was Icarus all those years, flying too close to the sun and searing because of it. But now, I had gotten to the sun when the clouds were overhead. Now, Lex and Clark, the two of you had a lot of moral issues boiling up in this episode. It started out with Victor Stone. He was um, an experiment of mine. He's not an experiment, Lex. He's a human being. Well, that's more than we can say about you right now, isn't it? Oh, Lex. This is why I never told you his secret. I knew you'd be immature about it. Anyways, I was trying to save Victor from dying in a car crash and trying to rejuvenate him through my science. But Clark here had to eradicate the miracles I was creating for his own fear of moral ambiguity. There's nothing ambiguous about locking someone up and trying to turn them into a robot, Lex. Besides, even if it is an ambiguous world, it's a good one. I happen to care about the people who live in it. Each person counts. See, that's what I love about this episode. It focuses on the main theme that makes Smallville so special. What does it take to be a hero? And what is the right way to go about being a hero in our modern day world? Boys! Boys, please! Who wants ice cream? Well, there you have it, folks. An episode from the perspectives of the characters. My name is Matthew Roca, and this is Smallville Panel. Until next time, have a great night.